Hello everyone, welcome back to the Yog Vlog. We're here in Australia at Bunnings. I keep seeing somebody saying that it's the Bunning, Bunning City. Something to do with Billy the Australian. Australian. Steve, how you doing? Thank you. Bunnings. Oh, way better than Bunnings. Oh, Fucking sucks at Bunnings. Work. Don't come to Bunnings. Shit, I want to go. <laughs> I really want to go to Bunnings <laughs> now. No one is helping <laughs> us here at Bunnings. <laughs> We're at minus 47 gold a turn here at Bunnings. For God's <laughs> sakes. <laughs> Will somebody please help Bunnings? We've done one day of Rooster Teeth Expo. It yep. was fantastic. Oh my God. We had a panel. We met hundreds of people. Hundreds. We did a dedicated signing session. Then we went to our booth to try and sign there. But of course, there was no merch no, there. So it was just it was just a black an wall. empty space and us and us. But we got to meet loads of yeah. guys. It was amazing. I thought maybe we should just get, get, a, a snag. get a coffee and a snag. I want a bunny snag. Um, follow us. Yeah, mate. Follow as we go into the wonderful world of bunnies. Of bunnies. It's just a whole best store. It's literally a whole best store. Right. Look at this, mate. 82V lead glass console. 750 watts of brushless motor. It's got 500 CFM air volume and five year replacement. So why are we in Bunnings? <laughs> <laughs> you don't know why we're in Bunnings. You should, you should, there's a, there was a thing about it and this Christmas lunch thing. We'll cut a bit of that in now. Yeah. Bunnings! And so we're here for RTX. We're in Australia for Rooster Teeth Expo. They very kindly invited us here. It's a really cool place. Um, we did a panel yesterday mm. we, um, where we talked about a little bit about what we did, but we can sort of talk about that again because it wasn't recorded, it wasn't streamed. It was just for the Australians only. Yeah. Um, but yeah, so we've, we've been here, we, we, we went to Singapore on the way to Australia. We stopped off for two days. Lovely so warm. It was far too warm. Duncan had his Factor 70 sun cream. That's true. Yeah. Uh, which comes in stick wow, form. Wow, mate. lithium ion handheld pocket chains. <laughs> wow. That's um... So we went to Singapore, it was amazing. <laughs> this is a really interesting place. Ooh. And uh, yeah. Parrot. That's not a parrot. Hi, how's it going? And then we went around this, the, the cloud forest. Cloud forest. Oh. It's like, it was like being inside a terrarium. It was great. It was a really interesting yeah. place to spend a day. And I think that was just about as long as we could stand it as well. Yeah. Um, yeah. And now we're here in Australia. We've ordered uh, two meters of heat. Two meters. Oh my God. Looking good there, Lewis. All right. It was a bit sunny for you, wasn't it? Very sunny. I haven't worn my sunglasses. I've all got any suntan cream on. So, fortunately, they sell these hats at very <laughs> discounted prices. I think that it just goes so well with the jacket. Do you know how much this cost? Uh, no. Eight Australian dollars. That's cheap. Eight Aussie dollars, mate. So it looks like it's worth Get more than that. Get two snacks for it. So the, the thing that we all love the most so far in Australia has to be said, is uh, the bin chickens. You probably have no idea what they are, because we had no idea what, what they were. Before no, they and Australians just assumed that we knew what they were, yeah. and that we had them as well. And they were like, well, you don't have these? But you mean you bin chickens? No, of course we do. How do you, how does all the rubbish get picked up off the floor? What about all the ham sandwiches lying around? Where does your bin chicks go? So they're enormous birds that just eat, they eat out of bins. They've got special designed beaks that are perfect at ripping open bins. <laughs> So there was this moment at the zoo where the zoo, the bin chickens had surrounded this poor, poor young man. There was like a little kid about this, this tool, like probably like four, four or five years old. Yeah. And he was like eating his, eating his ham sandwich for lunch. And then suddenly he looked down and there was like five or six bin chickens surrounding him, like slowly walking away forward. Like just, just, just carefully, step by step. Yeah. 
and he started panicking. He, he started like, stamping his feet like this. <laughs> and they kept getting closer and closer until he finally, he snapped. He panicked. He screamed this like heartfelt, agonizing scream. <laughs> and he, he took his he hand panic, He threw his hand at him. And threw it at the bin chips. <laughs> I mean, I, I assume, like, in the way that it was like a ball or a stone, though. It yeah. seemed like, go away. He, he was like throwing it at them to try and hit them. They, they obviously loved it, and they descended on him like a pack of vultures, trying to get this ham sandwich that he threw. It was, he was one of the funniest out. moments I think I've ever seen. It was, it, so was it didn't happen, it wasn't as long-winded as that, wanna, that story. Sorry, you want to buy a chainsaw? Right. Let's move out of your way. Yeah, I'm great. hopeless. So, okay. <laughs> She's waiting, there's a lady politely waiting for us to... Uh, yeah, sorry. <laughs> that's okay. I'll do my it's all right, don't worry. Okay, you got it. It's a good story. <laughs> oh my god. Let's um. <laughs> <laughs> get some ratchet. <laughs> I mean... Uh. <laughs> How did you find this? What is this? So we found We found the mystical snags. We followed our noses, right? <laughs> it's actually like a bird. <laughs> the barbecue. So we've hit the minor snag with the snags. We don't have any money. You got some money? Yeah, we've got money. We're having a great time in Australia. There may be more vlogs like this. There may not. Um, until then, thank you, Australia. You've been lovely. And um, maybe we'll see you next year. Bye for now. Bunnings out. Goodbye from Bunnings.